Welcome back to the show, everybody. It's time for Off the Gridiron. Every Tri-State football team wants as much support as they can get, and it comes in many forms, whether it's the fans applauding a good play or the cheerleaders chanting to keep the morale high. And, well, there's one Tri-State team that has a player who knows how to pick a team up from all angles. Yeah, that's right, and that's important. Keeping a team's energy high and morale high is vital to success, and for Central, they have just that. When you think of cheer, you may first think of the cheerleaders at Friday Night Lights, but for Central, they have one on their football roster as well. Killian Woolsey is a running back and linebacker right after school, but after that, he trades in the pads for the mats. And if you're wondering why he's became so enthralled with the sport, it's simple. Um, I wanted to do flips. I, I thought flipping was really cool. And it was the challenge of learning this sport that hooked him. And it's one of the hardest sports I've gotten into, and, and it, was, it took a lot of time for me to learn what other people are starting to learn. Of course, you can't talk about being a running back or cheering without balance. For Woolsey, both sports are mutually beneficial. If you don't have good balance, you're going to get taken right off your feet. Yeah, I need balance to bounce through holes. I need balance to land when I tumble. I need balance to do everything, really. I need... I need balance just to, to keep my, my feet on the ground. But what's unique about this sport is that you have to look good while performing at a high level. That requires leadership and a lot more energy than other sports to help the team do both. His coach and the gym's owner, Shane Wyckoff, says Woolsey brings both of those to the table. You know, when he's here at practices, he just really encourages his teammates. He understands the value of teamwork and what it means to be a good sport, and people look up to him for that. And that's what he does really well for his team, is he's able to, you know, keep a good morale the team and the team's able to look up to him and and luckily for the central football program that's the exact type of player that head coach brandon artist wants and build a foundation and build a culture of identity where we will not quit we're going to do whatever it takes and you're going to lose some guys on, around along the way and on the gridiron he supports his team while on the roster but come basketball season he's still cheering some of his teammates on just not on the playing surface the main difference between that and their competitions is showing support for another sport versus competing in their own and i'll be doing what i do here but just out on the basketball court and i'll be actually like cheering for teams out here we don't really cheer for teams we we're just competing and we're showing we're showing our athleticism. And his cheer team at Supreme Athletics, pretty good too. Just placing second at the World Championships yeah. down in Florida earlier this year. It's certainly an amazing story. Coming up though, we will hand out our stickers for the week. Find out who we really thought stood out when we huddle up for the two-minute drill.